simple three ingredient mango and cream enjoy everyone I wish I can use the mangoes from the Philippines, the very ripe Manila mangoes uh, or pico na manga. So I'm using the canned mangoes because I want the mangoes to be really soft. And I am just slicing it just like that. And if you don't want to use uh, mangoes, you can use peaches. We're using two cans of the mango. The other one I slice into chunks. This one I am just leaving the way it is and I am saving the syrup. I got the syrup the first one that I showed you. Just coating a spring form cake pan with cooking spray. And I will arrange the big slices of mangoes at the bottom. I was gonna arrange it in a flower like round arrangement but I realized the slices are too big I didn't want to mess up slicing it anymore it may look mushy so I'm leaving it alone. That's cornstarch everybody so the syrup is very sweet we will use this instead of using sugar but if you're using really super ripe fresh mangoes then use sugar for now i am using the syrup from the canned ripe mangoes at least one cup okay using two cans of evaporated milk and we're going to warm the milk turning on the heat using medium heat and let's warm the milk totally optional everyone one teaspoon of good vanilla extract okay still using medium heat and I'm now stirring it and um, about three minutes I can see that it's now about to boil so I just turn off the heat and what I'm going to do is I will add the mangoes immediately after that this is what I'm going to do I will add the mango syrup to the cornstarch and I will stir it and whisk it until I know the cornstarch is completely dissolved with the heavy syrup and now slowly add it to the cream and mango mixture still no heat you know I just turned up the heat so let's stir it first before we turn on the heat one more time using medium heat okie dokie so now let's uh, keep stirring it until it's thick look at this everybody check this out in about 30 seconds you see how thick it gets I'm going to turn off the heat now after about 30 seconds of constant stirring and I will just keep on doing this until I know this is the texture that I want to achieve maybe another 10-15 seconds okay total stirring time one minute over medium heat and I turned off the heat after 30 seconds and I continue to whisk it uh, for another 30 seconds now it's thick let's transfer it to the cake pan And just flatten it with a metal spatula everyone please take note 
if for any reason that you feel that you want to add more sugar to it please do so like what you uh, have seen earlier I use the heavy syrup that came with mangoes in a can if you're using fresh mangoes then use sugar and taste it and adjust the sweetness according to your preference So we are going to cool this down completely in the fridge, everybody. And then I will release the spring form right here on the side. And I will show it to you. You could just imagine how pretty it looks. Let's wait and see. So here it is after two hours of chilling it in the fridge. Okay, let's turn it over first. Simple three ingredient mango and cream. Enjoy everyone. Okay everyone, thank you for watching the cooking video. Alright, until the next dish. Siron Bilaro po. All my love to you guys.